Hello guys, hope you are doing good. In this video, you are going to learn about the installation of Hyper-V on Windows 10. Hyper-V is basically a virtualization software used in Windows environment to set up a virtual machine. You can set up Windows or Linux or Solaris, whatever operating system you want to set up as a virtual machine in your uh, windows operating operating system you can do using hyper-v so uh, let's start the installation you need to go to start menu and uh, search for turn windows features on or off click on this it's loading search for Hyper-V Hyper-V is basically a default uh, uh, feature of Windows so uh, there is no need to download any installer or uh, go to any website you can just uh, uh, open Windows features and uh, enable both options and click on ok button it will automatically install the hyper-v for uh, your windows now it's searching for required files now it will download the required files and install them automatically Now it's applying the changes. Uh, now it's done and it's asking for restart so uh, let's restart the system So guys after restart uh, it will show this message working on features do not turn off your computer let's wait for the installation to complete so guys we are back after restart uh, now let's search for hyper-v in start menu Uh, here is your Hyper-V manager, open it. It's uh, same like uh, other virtualization software. It's very easy to manage and uh, it's a very stable uh, approach to install a virtual machine. So let's connect to your local server click on local computer click on ok now here uh, you can create a new virtual machine or you can import a virtual machine if you have uh, any backup of your old virtual machine we are going to click on new virtual machine now click on next name your virtual machine like I am going to set up a CentOS 
I name it Centos. Now click on next. Uh, go with the default configurations. Now uh, define the memory you are going to assign to your virtual machine. Click on next. Network. Select your network. Go with the default switch. Click on next. Now create a virtual hard disk. Go with the default configuration. I am going with uh, 30 GB. Click on next button. Install the operating system from bootable CD or DVD ROM. Uh, if you have uh, ISO image file, select uh, your uh, VM's ISO virtual file. I have uh, ISO image of CentOS 7 so I am going to select it click on open click on next finish so as you can see my virtual machine is ready let's connect the machine Click on start button. As you can see, the installation of CentOS has been started. So guys now you can proceed with the installation of your operating system. Uh, this guide is good enough to understand the uh, enablement of Hyper-V virtualization software on your Windows 10 environment. Thanks for watching this video and uh, hit on subscribe button to follow us for further updates. Take care. Goodbye.